One second, please. Hello, guys. Do you have problem with that bar? Or is correct in your platform? Mm, I have oh. the correct answer. You have the correct answer. Yes. Mm. Really. Okay. I I will share it in the chat. Okay. Thank you. Yes. Okay, thank you. Welcome. Okay, so he told me that Nancy has never been. ¿Por qué had? Because remember, Nancy has never been skiing. That's present. So remember when we report, we go one back. It's anyone ready to leave? What did she ask? That, that anyone ready to leave? She asked if... If anyone was ready to leave. Pam lost a lot of weight. My mother told me. Pam lost a lot of weight. Okay, but one thing very important, listen, Pam, Pam lost a lot of weight. Lost is simple past. Mm -hmm. But remember, when we report the speech, we have to go one more back. So what is the, what is before simple past is past perfect. So my mother told me that Pam had lost a lot of weight. Fíjese que irónicamente esto es la misma gramática en español. Pam, Pam es corto por Pamela. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Pam perdió mucho peso. Oigan esto, perdió pasado. Mi madre me dijo que Pam perdió mucho peso o mi madre me dijo que Pam había perdido mucho peso. ¿Verdad que sería había? Mm -hmm. Lo mismo en inglés. Y okay. hey, mi mamá me dijo que Pam había perdido mucho peso. Eso es el had lost. Let me see what happened. Hmm, I got Nancy wrong. Nancy has never been skiing. He said that. Okay, let's see. It's only Nancy. But remember that is optional. <laughs> yeah. Y lo dijo. Okay. It's not Nancy, so. Bean. Bean. Being. Oh, yes. Oh, there you go. All right, we got it right. Hey, thank you, Vanya, for the chat. Okay. All right, now let me see. Complete the sentence. Instructions, complete the sentence with the verb in parentheses. Use the past perfect or simple past. Just type the verb in. But use the past perfect or simple past. Just type the verb in. Do not... Do not need to worry about capital letters. A 
about capitalism. Okay. As soon as I got to class, my teacher blank us a pop ki a pop quiz. Gay. Okay. Okay. Do you know what is a pop quiz? Yes. What is it? It's like a, a exam. It's a surprise exam. Yeah, Nobody has was expecting. Surprise exam. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I got a dog last year. Up until then, I never had. Never, never had. I never had mm -hmm. any pets. Sam and Sue got married on Sunday. The next day, they went. Yes. They went on a trip. My Chinese class went out for dim sum. Before that, blank it before. I've never tasted. I have never tasted. Have never. I have never tasted it. Lara, Lara, sorry, Lara. Lara bought a car this summer. Until that time, she didn't know. Didn't know. Mm -hmm. She didn't did. Know. Mm -hmm. She did not know how to drive. Mm -hmm. The moment George canceled all his credit cards, he found. Oh, nunca le ha pasado eso. I hate that. That happened to me one day. I lost my wallet and I look I went crazy looking for my wallet. And ni modo, I canceled all my cards. I canceled everything. And the night I found my <laughs> oh, why is that wrong? Let me see. <laughs> Didn't, didn't know, maybe. Ah. <laughs> didn't. Okay, good. Can you give me an example for um like let me give an example. One time I went to San Miguel and we went to a discotheque and um Bachata was very big in San Miguel in the discotheque. So I danced. Until that time, I have never danced bachata. Mm -hmm. Do you understand that? Can you give me an example? In my case, I don't understand the question. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I went to San Miguel to a discotheque. Mm -hmm. And um, it's very popular, bachata in San Miguel. Yes. So I danced. Mm -hmm. Until that time, I have never danced bachata. Mm -hmm. You see, do you see what I'm saying? I'm, I didn't say I didn't dance bachata. Until that time, Mm -hmm. I have never danced bachata. Mm -hmm. All right. So that, that's but you, but you dance in that occasion. Yeah, I did. Um, mm -hmm. she, yeah, it was a very beautiful girl. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Teacher, you're gonna sleep in the sofa. No, I mean it was a very it was like what 15 years ago. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, you know, I mean, yeah. And, you know, like, I had, I mean, she was very beautiful. And, okay, anymore. You, you know, men, men, we have to sacrifice. 
<laughs> isn't, she, isn't she your wife? No. No, I I had not met my wife in that time. I met my wife maybe one year later. Okay. <laughs> hey, you know, my, the first date with my wife, we went to the movies and I watched Sex in the City. Can you imagine it? <laughs> oh, what a stupid movie. But it's the sacrifices that men do. <laughs> Have you ever danced with your wife, Bachata? Well, you know, I am very lucky that my wife doesn't like to dance. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm happy about that. <laughs> I was uh, born in Morazan and I have never heard about the Bachata in San Miguel. Well, you I never was... heard Bachata in San Miguel? is popular or what oh yeah well in that time it was it was very uh, popular. maybe in that time yes <laughs> but you know what i mean i think many years later bachata became popular because of um este romeo santos and blah 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 but no the bachata i'm talking about in san miguel it was like really good bachata mm -hmm. it was like it was nice and then this I, I, I heard about cumbia, but not about bachata. Oh, you never heard of bachata, really? Yes, but oh. in San Miguel, I don't know. I have never heard about the popular. What happened is that, uh, remember, San Miguel is very close to Honduras and Nicaragua. So there's a lot of like Nicaraguenses and Hondurians. And, and it has a lot of influence. Mm -hmm. And and I remember that girl I was dancing with, she was an expert in dancing. I was like, wow. <laughs> you know, but, but you know, I had drunk like 15 beers. Yes. It's not easy to dance, uh, Chata. No, it's not. It's not easy to no. dance. No. And it's a, uh, it's a sexy dance. <laughs> it is it's it's very artistic it's true yeah. It's, it's, yeah i remember and you know that's true because i remember that frequently when i went to discotheques in san miguel i used to enjoy watching people dance bachata yes it, yes. it was like wow i wish i could do that <laughs> yeah it, it was uh, one thing i don't understand is how did you manage to dance bachata with someone who knew how to dance when you don't dance? I was drunk. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> That's right. So, but did no, you live in San Miguel? Excuse me, sorry. Ivania, did what? you live in San Miguel? Yes, I did, like for two years. Oh. I was a teacher there. I, I love San Miguel. I have many memories. Of San where? Miguel. Teacher, where? I was in the European Academy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so I lived there like, I, I lived there like in the year 2000 and 2004, I think. But I love San Miguel. I, I, I remember, I have a lot of memories of San Miguel. I will go to San Miguel on Saturday. You know, remember me in this. The difference between somebody from San Miguel and somebody from San Salvador is this. The lempa. That, no, that <laughs> people from San Miguel don't sweat. Don't sweat, okay. No. I don't know why they don't sweat. Okay. When you will see somebody from San Salvador because their 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 shirt is extremely wet. <laughs> it's sticky. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe what happened to you, but the shirt will be very sticky and, and wet. Mm -hmm. And you're gonna be like, oh my God, it's hot. And then you really, I remember, I, I remember I saw the teachers of San Miguel, they went and with a tie and everything. And, and I remember <laughs> I and I say, You don't sweat? Why? Por qué? Por qué no sudan, man? Mm -hmm. I was like, oh my God. And they said, No, I'm normal. <laughs> Yes. Watch, you will see that people in San Miguel don't sweat. All right. When okay, I, so teacher, when I came to, to San Salvador from uh, Morazan, I usually wear sweaters all oh. the days until the 9 a.m. 
<laughs> you know, I believe you. I believe you because I remember when I lived in San Miguel, the only time it was, it was not cold. It was cool. It was like uh, fresco. It was cool. It was not cold. It was just like, it was maybe at 6.30 or 7 in the morning. Mm -hmm. Because I remember that's the time I, I walked outside my house and I walked in La Roosevelt and like, oh man, que si fuera, it would be good. Mm -hmm. And I remember I saw everybody with sweaters. Con, con sweater. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So you're from Morazan. Hey, King Flip is from Morazan, right? Yes, I'm from Morazan. Papa. Do you know King oh, Flip? Oh, my God. He's my trauma <laughs> teacher. In my work, everyone say that when I, I don't know, in my trauma. <laughs> Do you know King Flip? Uh -huh. the, yes. the first question, do you know yes. him? Yes, I know. <laughs> is your friend? No. <laughs> not, no, he's not my friend, but um, he lives near to my house, like to like 10 minutes or five minutes. Okay. So he, he actually lives in Morazan. He doesn't live in San Salvador. Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but the last year, Yes, he lives. He lived in in, Morazan, in San Francisco over there. Oh, but you know, I you have to respect the man. I mean, he ha, he is fighting. Yes. Yeah, yes. So, you know, so you know, um, you know, so my respects for him. I don't like that music. He, but... uh, actually, he he lived uh, in um, um, how do you say uh, in a popular colony. Or our neighborhood. Neighborhood, like uh, I don't know how do you say like marginal or I don't know where is mm -hmm. the word. You see, actually, um, eh, ahí está una buena pregunta porque fíjese que en inglés, por lo menos en Estados Unidos, eso no existe. Se, bueno, porque aquí si ustedes se dan cuenta existe cantón, colonia, vecindad, urbanización. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué más? Residencial. Residencial, todo y todo es lo mismo, que es vecindario. Mm. Mm. Ok, but uh, Entonces, the adjective to say... Lo más cercano person. sería marginal, sería un ghetto. Un ghetto. 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 Mm. Se escribe ghetto con dos ghetto. Mm. Pero ghetto es like... Um, ya, yeah, una zona marginal. Ghetto. Gangsters. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. But he lived in a, in a ghetto. In a, in a ghetto community. Oh, okay. Yes. He was dangerous um, many years ago. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Really dangerous. Yeah. Because so, it's near to the, uh, to the Centro Penal. Oh, to the jail. To the jail. Yes, <laughs> to the jail. <laughs> Oh, okay, okay. But you know, I mean, I hope I hope he does good. Yes. He's, he's funny. Though. Teacher. Yes. But his last song became popular. Yes. Mm -hmm. I like. I oh, like that, that, that song about that song about El Salvador. Yes. Oh yeah, I, I like, like that song. Lot. Yeah. You know, I like the remoto. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I remember, I remember one Christmas party, they put that song, you know, um, <laughs> with, with a lot of volume, it sounds, it sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. And so it's a little conceited. I imagine. Yeah. Yes. I don't like it for this. <laughs> but you know what? Sometimes, sometimes it's very, very difficult because like, let me give you an example. Um, my my childhood, yes, my childhood, mm -hmm. my childhood best friend, it was, um, you know, Roberto Acosta? You know mm -hmm. Roberto Acosta? Yeah. Okay. Yes. So we were very, I mean, we are very good friends, but, you know, but, you know, mm -hmm. when you get married and, and, and this, it, but sometimes we have dinner or we, we see each other. He, he visits me or I visit him. But um, it's very difficult because I remember one time we were in Los Cebollines. 
and <laughs> we 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 did not have peace because a lot of people came. Oh, can I have a picture? Oh, can I have a picture? Oh, can I have a picture? He really couldn't eat. Mm -hmm. So and it came and he said, "Please just let me finish eating and tell me about los tacos," you know. And then and then everybody said, "Ah, creído te la pica," you know. I was like, mm -hmm. "Oh my God, qué mala onda!" Solo pidió permiso para terminar los tacos y. So I don't know the public life. It must be very. Yeah, por eso no soy famoso. Cuando oigan donaciones de millones anónimos, it's me. But <laughs> I just I don't like to say it because then people. No, no, I'm joking. It's funny because you know in my neighborhood where where I grew up, in that block, in that block where I grew up. Everybody mm -hmm. became famous mm -hmm. because in that block, that's where Roberto lived. And next to Roberto lives um, El Borrego. Do you know Borrego? Yes. Mm -hmm. it, it, it was like a coincidence. Mm -hmm. Una gran casualidad that they live next to each other. And then in front of my house lives Ligia from Salsa Clave. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. so that block is como es que le dicen Hollywood. Así le dicen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hasta pena me da que yo no me hice famoso. Porque <laughs> todo así es cierto. Like, like everybody became famous except me. <laughs> All right, so. But in a way you are famous because there is a lot of students who knows you. You and know, you are in YouTube, so you are influencer. I am, I am, yes, I am an influencer. But you know what? Sometimes I, I sometimes it's sad because sometimes I forget the students. But the problem uh -huh. is, imagine I've been a teacher for 20 years. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and sometimes I I, rem I remember my first grade, second grade. No, I remember my fifth, sixth grade teachers because it's easier to remember one teacher than to remember. 20 students every month. I do remember faces. Mm -hmm. I remember one time I was with my wife and I mm -hmm. saw this beautiful girl mm -hmm. teacher and she was so happy when she saw me. Oh, hi. <laughs> Por qué no me acuerdo de usted? Oh, why? I, I, I don't know why you're talking to myself. I don't remember you. Why? <laughs> <laughs> and she, but she was so happy and she hugged me and then, you know I told my wife oh she's a student but oh, I'm from the <laughs> professor and then I'm buena gente me compraba churros <laughs> <laughs> and I, when was I your teacher it was like 10 years ago obviamente tenía 8 años la niña creo <laughs> and I said oh that's why I don't <laughs> <laughs> because sometimes I teach children and I, you know we give candies to children Mm -hmm. yeah. ah. <laughs> and you, you know when you're a little girl to like when you're 15 like 15 years later there's a big difference like wow <laughs> all right so back to the bachata I had never danced bachata until I I went to for example I had never eaten mayonnaise curtido until I went to San Miguel mm -hmm. And I like it, it's good. What about Morasan, Ivania, too? It's in the same in Morasan. Oh. But you have the two options. Yeah, you do. Yeah, okay. Does anyone have a story? I have never done this until. Um. <laughs> Okay, let me see how good is your listening. Miguel Franco, where where did Ivania said she lived? Ivania said that she lived in Modelo. <laughs> oh my God. Yes, <laughs> no. no. King Flip, King Flip, remember? Ah, King Flip in, in Morrison. Okay, but good. <laughs> she in, said she in, said she said not... that she lived in Morazan. Okay, good. So Ivania, you are originally from Morazan. Yes, I so, was born in Morazan. 
but in Modelo, you live with your family. What? You live in a Modelo, right? You live in a Modelo, right? No, I have never. No, no, wait, I'm sorry. Who lives by the zoo? I forgot. No, no. She lives like a model. <laughs> oh, like a model. No. No, but, oh, yes, that's true. <laughs> who, no, but remember, somebody in this class, I remember somebody lives mm -hmm. by the zoo. Me yes, too, Annie. Anavilma. Oh, Anavilma, yes, it's, it's you. Yes. yes. Ah, okay, I'm sorry, I'm I confused. From, I'm from. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah. You live in front by, by the um, laboratory. Near right? the yes. Okay. And Ivania, you live in, in San Salvador, right? Yes. Or in Morazan, no? No, I, today I live in San Salvador. But you are from Morazan, Papa, right? <laughs> yes, teacher, yes. <laughs> ah. Ivania Romero Flip. I know. <laughs> no. <laughs> No, I'm joking. Okay. And the news are Ivania get married with. <laughs> oh man. King Flip ya no está solo. Oh my God. Solo King Flip ya no está solo ni abandonado, baby. All right. Okay, so tell me a story. Sarah, it's coming. Tell me a story that that something you have never done until something. But like, tell I me have something. never, um, I have never drink alcohol until now. Oh, no, <laughs> uh, what? Um, how do you say hasta ahora? Until now. Until now, okay. But you said I have. It's actually I have. It's I bad. have. <laughs> but if you drink alcohol, you have a problem. No, I no. Um, I have never drink alcohol. No, because uh -huh. if you if you drink alcohol, that's a problem, man. Because I know people people <laughs> no, drink okay. the, liquor. The, the idea is I have never drink alcohol. No, no, I understand. No, but it's not alcohol. It's liquor. Liquor. Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because if if you drink alcohol, alcohol, you have a okay. very big problem. Yes. No, it's okay. No, I understand, but remember. Uh, hey, teacher, I yeah. have never, I have never used hand sanitizer until pandemia. That's true. Me too. Yes, I had never used a hand sanitizer until the pandemic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think I had never used a mask. <laughs> yeah. Until yeah. the pandemic, too. All right. What about you, uh, Luis? Give me an example. Okay, okay, teacher, I had never eat, eaten, uh, eaten uh, pupusas and uh, lunch until coming the pandemia. Really? Are you serious? Yes. You had never eaten pupusas for lunch until the pandemic? For lunch, yeah. Oh, man. I have, I have eaten pupusas for lunch. <laughs> no, look, I, like <laughs> I like pupusas anytime. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> only for dinner. I don't like for lunch. Only for dinner or maybe lunch. Uh, no, but what? No, you know, one time I was going to the airport. And, no, we were coming back from the airport and my uncle said, I'm hungry. Let's stop to eat pupusas. And I said, but, uh, come on, it's lunch. No, quiere pollo campero. no, I want pupusas. So we ate pupusas and it was so good. <laughs> <laughs> so after that, you know, pupusas for lunch is okay. Cool. <laughs> okay. My wife has never gone to a second hand store. Mm -hmm. Do you know what it's? Do you understand a second? Yes. Hand? Yes. 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 So my wife has never gone to a second oh, hand center. store until she met me. <laughs> <laughs> I am addicted to those stores. Really? Yes. <laughs> But not not for yeah the clothes is important but I like more like strange things that you find mm -hmm. collectible things. Mm -hmm. Oh, for the economy, teacher. No, for the economy. But <laughs> you know, I for example, I I like taking photographs, and sometimes I see there. I say, I say, you need to know what And sometimes I've seen some flashes. You, oh my god, 
How much is that? Six dollars. See, me the way please. <laughs> Thank you. you know, or, 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 yeah, I, I like those. Those things. All right, very good. Marielos, give me an example. I have never um, carry, carry. How do you say carry in past tense? Carried. Carried a baby before I, until I gave, gave birth my first child. Really? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, did you understand what she said? That very good example. Yes. So, oh, okay, wow. You had never had a baby in your arms until you had... never before that. Wow. I didn't I... know how to take how to take him out of mm -hmm. the the cuna. Crib. Crib. I didn't know how to do that. Oh man. <laughs> okay. and my 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 husband and uncle helped yes. me. She, he he told me how to do it. <laughs> Mm. Okay. Mm. <laughs> what about you as a mother or father? Are you like the typical that when you buy something for your baby, you know the size? Like, for example, my wife, she knows everything about my son, the tamaño, peso, everything. I don't. For example, mm -hmm. I, I know his foot is from this finger to this hand. <laughs> sure. I know his head is like this. Mm -hmm. Yes. Teacher, I need to, to say something. It's about sure, my sorry. daughter. It's dying again. Oh, sorry. No. I work on the platform and for for that reason, my daughter is dying now. Oh, okay. And oh. the section three. Oh, but you know what? It's almost 30 minutes. Sorry, we almost finished bye. the class. Okay, it's okay. Thank you, Roxana. Bye. Bye, teacher. Before it dies, do you want to give an example? Oh. I think it's she gone. died. All right, Nuri, give us an example. I like I li that, that Marielo's example was very interesting. Okay. I have, I have never eaten insects. Insects? Uh -huh. Insects, like a grillo or saltamonte, mm -hmm. uh, before I went to Mexico City. Um, no, but you know, that's good also before I went okay. because that says before she went. So that means okay. after Mexico, she ate. Okay. okay. Awesome. Interesting. Interesting. Ana Vilma, give us an example. I had never been to the zoo until I started living in front. <laughs> <laughs> Ana Vilma, are you there? Hmm. Not there. Okay. <laughs> let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, Ivania, give us an example. Oh, no, Mirna. Mirna. There's Mirna. Sorry about that. Good night, teacher, and everybody. Good night. You, you go, you're leaving? Uh -huh. <laughs> good evening. <laughs> Remember, have, good, good night I, is to say goodbye. Good night okay. is to say goodbye. Good evening hello. is to say hello. Okay, teacher. I have never mm. slept in the beach until today and see a sunset. Okay, good. Se me hace que es bien copiada de algún libro de texto. No. So, are you, yeah, that, are you in the beach in this moment? No. <laughs> you see? <laughs> because you said I had never slept on the beach until now. Until today. <laughs> That, that's like a very example from a textbook. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no, but it's it. true. <laughs> oh, no, oh, no. Okay, no, but that was a good example, though. Yes. <laughs> All right. Okay, good. Um, interesting. I had never seen drama, drama, mm -hmm. until I went to the Primero de Mayo hospital. Mm -hmm. That was really impact age. It was, mm -hmm. it was, I am, I am so happy. I am very, very happy that the government or I don't know who they made a, a piece of a floor for the mothers to sleep. Mm -hmm. 
because my baby, when he my baby was born, he was two weeks in a, in a bubble. Mm -hmm. But it was it was good technology. But okay. and this was like six years ago, and I remember there was a the baby next to my baby. He was one year old, but only mm -hmm. his head grew. His body didn't. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, it was so, it was, it was very shocking. And I remember that the baby was from Metapan. The mother was from Metapan. And I was thinking, visiting hours is at one and five. And I spoke with the mother and the mother was there every day for one year. Can you imagine that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Where do you, I'm sorry, where do you sleep? She says, anywhere in a gas station. Porque, ah, oh, man, it was, it was sad. It was sad. And I remember I gave her money. Y yo me podía pensar, the hospital no tiene. O sea, for mothers that, imagine mothers from Musulután or La Unión or that they need to have the babies there. Ni modo, they have, you know. But now um, I remember that El Ministro, they, they presented that un piso del hospital que estaba abandonado, no sé qué, lo llenaron de camas para esas madres. So man, I was very happy when, when I saw that because I had never seen drama until I went inside that room. Mm. It was very, it was very sad. Yes. It was a big impact. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, but I'm very happy that now the mothers, they have a place to stay and sleep. Yes. All right. So that's how you practice. I have never blah, 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 blah until. Blah, blah, mm -hmm. blah, blah, blah. Okay. Class, I hope you have a great weekend. Thank you for this week. Be good. And I will mm -hmm. see you tomorrow, uh, Monday. Okay. <laughs> Monday. Monday. <laughs> okay. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. Okay. Thank, Thank you, everybody. Thank, Thank you. Bye-bye.